Next, we have Lot 13. Many believe this fountain pen, patented in 1884, to be the very one that signed Grover Cleveland into office. Other stylophiles believe it belonged to Samuel Langhorne Clemens, better known by his pen name of Mark Twain. Legend has it the pen was stolen in 1910 when Halley's Comet passed over, as did Twain. Still others think it's just an old pen found in a Connecticut yard sale. So shall we start the bidding at $5 or $500,000? Are you ready to see yourself as others see you? I didn't know I was so gray. Just for Men takes off the years gray puts on. Shampoos away gray fast and now has vitamins. Brings back a thicker, healthier, natural look. I like what I see. Just for Men takes off the years. Now, Jennings, I, the hard-nosed businessman, am on holiday. But I'm also monitoring my sales and stock levels on my PDA from... Orange, correct? And in the last nine minutes, the aforementioned stock levels are static, which tells us what? Staff are sleeping, Father? Slacking, Jennings, slacking! Business never sleeps. Good, that's enough for today. The hard-nosed businessman can now access sales information in real time. Bright business from Orange.